everyone. Welcome to Craft Challenge Thursday. Today you will learn how to make a no sew pouch for small items that you might have at home. These little pouches can be used to put things that you have or you can make the pouches as gifts for someone else. To make these you're going to need fleece material and it doesn't have to be very big it depends upon how big you want your pouch a paper plate or some type of round object that you can use to trace the size of your pouch you'll also need scissors good cutting scissors because you'll be cutting material a pencil or a marker and some ribbon and it doesn't matter if you don't have ribbon you can use yarn or some type of twine that you have it's your craft it's your pouch you can design it the way you'd like so you're going to place your object on your material and i think i could make more than one with this material so i'm going to place my plate here and I'm going to use a pencil and I'm going to trace around the plate so we can cut and I don't know if you can see but it did make the shape of the plate take your scissors and cut out your shape I've already cut out a round shape for us to use to make our bag. Next step is putting the markings where you're going to make the little loops to place your ribbon. We'll have to make several little openings so you can lace your ribbon through. So the easiest way to do that is to pretend that this round shape is a clock face. And you're going to make two little lines uh, about a half an inch from the edge at 6 o'clock, at 12 o'clock, 3 o'clock, and 9 o'clock. So I made my little markings to show you those different times. Once you have your little markings and they're about a half an inch from the edge, you're going to fold your fleece over, take your scissors and make two small little cuts. Don't cut all the way to the edge because you just need that little small opening to place your ribbon. Continue around, looking at your markings and making a small little cut so you'll have two little slits where you can put your ribbon. Now you have those cuts. You're going to make two little slits at one o'clock, two o'clock, four o'clock, five o'clock, seven o'clock, eight o'clock, 10 o'clock, 11 o'clock. Continue and cut your slits. Remember to leave it about half an inch from the edge. Once you have all of your slits cut, now it's time to thread your ribbon through. Just find the little hole, place your ribbon, do the first set, and pull. and then continue all the way 
around. And you see as we go through each of the loops, pull it, it's making our bag shape. If you do not have fleece material, you can use felt. Felt doesn't ravel either once you cut it, so that's a good material to use. But it needs to be felt that's soft, not the really stiff felt that you might find in some areas of the, of the store. So you're welcome to use just regular material also, but you might have to make a little stitch to keep the material from raveling. have your ribbon in each one of your slits. You can pull your little bag, work with it, tie a knot on each end of your ribbon so it doesn't go through your holes. Now you have your very own no-sew pouch that you can place your jewelry or items that you have laying around, earbuds, and you can also give these as gifts. And this is your no so pouch tutorial. Remember, if you make one and you'd like to show us what you've made, you can add it to the comments section on our Facebook page. And a uh, happy making. Enjoy making several of these no-sew pouches for someone special. Thanks, see you again.